we're going to do another demonstration of synchronizing two AC three-phase generators. We have these two three-phase generators hooked up on belt drives to a pair of AC induction motors that are being powered by some VFDs. So we have the ability to control the driving frequency of the VFDs to control how fast or slow they're trying to spin. And then we can take these two generators and electrically link them together through our circuit breaker network. Presently, both generators' breakers are closed, and so they're on the same grid, so to speak, and they are now electrically coupled together. Our stroboscope, which is putting out a flashing light signal, is showing this coupling, and you can see that when you align the two tape marks in your vision, you can see that these two tape marks are showing these two generator shafts to be in sync with each other. They're going at the same speed, they're not drifting at all, because again, they are electrically coupled with each other. What I'm going to do now is purposely slow down the prime mover on the foreground generator. I'll slow down the frequency going to this motor so it tries to spin slower. Since these two generators are still electrically coupled together, electrically linked together, they will still spin at the same speed, but this one won't be trying to spin as hard as before. In fact, it'll be trying to slow down, and as a result, this will begin to act as a motor, and the background generator will act as a true generator. So watch as I slow the frequency down on the motor here from 60 hertz down to about 59. So 60, 59.8, 59 59.6, 59.5, 59.3, 59.4, let's try that again, 59.2. So what's happened now is I've slowed this down, or I've tried to slow it down, I should say, and as a result, this generator is not being mechanically spun as hard as it was before. It's actually now receiving power from the other generator as a motor to try to keep up the speed. And as a result, you can see a slight splaying of the angles in the tapes. This one should look like it's further clockwise or further behind rotation of the background generator. Now I'm going to speed up the prime mover on this, and when I do so, you'll see the tapes come closer into alignment with each other. So here we go, 59.2, 59.3, 0.4, 0.5, 0.6, 0.7, 0.8, 0.9, 0.10, 0.11, 0.12, 0.13, 0.14, 0.15, 0.16, 0.17, 0.18, 0.19, 0.20, 0.